Hi class, this is Jerry. I'm doing a quick video for you uh, to show you how to mask. I don't know if we went over it thoroughly enough in class, so I wanted to do this quick video for you. Remember, uh, I did the sketch of the dog, and then with my, let's move this over here a little bit, with the pen tool, I made mostly straight lines, but also some curved lines, okay? Okay, there's a selection tool again. All right, let's me click on, there we go. I have two pages here in my uh, Adobe Illustrator uh, artboard. Um, so you have a left and a right, so don't be confused by that. Uh, I have this set up for 11 by uh, 17. Okay, so here's, here's our guy again, the dog. So that's just the outline I have it in, let's check. There we go, for stroke one point, black. Okay, so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, now what we're gonna do, let's put this guy up here. We are going to do file, place, because I wanna get some texture in here. So um, I've already decided that for, um, since mine is dogs of, um, dog days of summer, and it's gonna be a concert in the park, I'm going to put sheet music in for the dogs, okay? So I got this labeled best sheet music. Uh, I think that's the one I want, place. And again, now it's holding on my cursor. You need to click in the upper left and drag down, okay? And there we go. Um, what I'm gonna do now is pull it down and I'm gonna click on the dog, the outline, and place that on the top. And I'm moving them around, so I'm kind of trying to pick where I want the notes to be. I want an area right here so I can place in an eye. I want it left open, okay? So be sure your, your um, line art is on the top. Just in case, do Arrange, Bring to Front. Click on your paper. Arrange, send to back. Now this paper over here is a JPEG, okay? It's basically a Photoshop file, save that's a JPEG, all right? So we're gonna put, uh, that's a pixeled file, and we're going to do a mask of our vector on top of it, okay? Click off. Okay, click again on the upper left, pull, drag, uh, I see we got two dogs here. Let's get rid of one. Sorry. Send, send one away. Okay. Click. Drag. Okay, there we go. Go up to Object. Clipping Mask. Make. And it's really that easy. Okay. There's some areas you don't see because it's a very light... Um, it's a very light gray, almost white, for the sheet music. So what we're going to do is uh, do an outline. And we're going to do a stroke of, come on, we're going to do a stroke of one point. Okay. And I may get rid of that, I may keep it, but just depending on how, how well it's defined. I want to import, get rid of this. I'm going to import the grass now, the paper that I made green. So let's go File, Place. Uh, here we go. Stain green uh, paper copy, Place. And once again, it's holding it. So I'm going to click here and just pull. There we go. Okay. And there's our dog. Uh, we need to have him bring to front. There we go. Okay, and then if you want, you can keep the outline if you want. You can also click on it and go up to Effect, Stylize, Drop Shadow. We did this in class. Don't make your drop shadows too uh, dark, though. Okay, let's do 55 for opacity. Click Preview, and that's pretty good, okay? I'm not crazy about drop shadows. I think they've been overdone and people are kind of getting burnt out on them. Let's do, let's click on it and see if we can get rid of that stroke. Let's do, 
Well, let's totally get rid of it. Let's click up here. This is our swatches. This is the black stroke. Let's do none. See what it looks like. Do that again. None. I think I'm going to leave it off, okay? Anyway, so that's it. That's how you make a mask. I would like you all to learn that and also use the uh, pen tool for drawing. Uh, whether it's in here, when you want to do further masking, or just for the rest of this assignment, okay? Thanks.